Hello to everyone watching this footage. It's Leviathan here again. And to start things off, I'm going to introduce myself to newcomers. I'm born high functioning autistic. I'm obsessed with fiction, and I'm planning to make my own creative universe like the late Stanley did. For the sake of social recognition, instead of three, sometimes four characters, I'm going to do just two. So that way I could see if there would be an increase in social recognition, you know? Hope you enjoy. Sorry. Here's the first character. Slow-mo. Real name, Moses Spinner. Height, 5 feet 9 inches. Weight, 152 pounds. Status, anti-hero and lover of light speed. Base, Las Vegas, Alpha Earth, Mobile. Intelligence, 3 brains. Behavior. Charming, confident, and sneaky. He would do anything to please his true love, even if it kills him. Lethality. He will be done before you know it. Weaknesses. He's a bad fighter. Powers. He can slow down the flow of time, enabling him to even go down to plank time. He also has uncanny reasoning skills. Eyes bluish, hair brownish blackish, and scruffy. Origin. Moses Spinner was born with hyperactivity, making it hard to be trusted by others in life. One day, Moses was experimented on by Russian to cure his hyperactivity, along with gaining the power to slow down the flow of time. Soon, Slow Mo got prideful to the point that he went robbing the casinos in Las Vegas. However, when Lightspeed showed up, she was going so fast that she tackled him in the visual speed of a normal pace. After beating him up, Moses convinced her not to hurt him and to give him mercy. Since then, Slow Mo and Lightspeed were in a love-hate relationship, and Moses would do all he can to make her happy to avoid getting hurt. Costume, he normally dresses in casual wear. Team solitary with light speed and others. Urge inspiration, plague time. Here's the other character. Zombie. Real name, Zombie Plant. Height, 2 million feet. Weight, unrevealed. Status, villain and native of the Rotten Dimension. Base, Rotten Dimension mobile. Intelligence, two brains. Behavior, bloodthirsty, destructive and always hungry. She'll do anything to feast on as much raw flesh as possible. Lethality. Extremely deadly, not to mention being undead. Weaknesses. Her stomach, cranial damage, and missing parts. Powers. She has the same powers as Bean, along with zombie-based capabilities. She later gained the ability to travel across time and space. Eyes deep red, hair deep black and scruffy. Origin. When she was examining the towering Bean... Cosmic decided that she could find some way to use her as a weapon. She then traveled to the Rotten Dimension, a reality where everything is undead, where she persuaded an undead being to stagger through an interdimensional portal and start rampaging across the New York City of the default Earth. When the military found that she can't be stopped, they decided to call out to Bean for help. After a long fight, Bean had finally defeated Zombie by tearing all her limbs apart, and later asked Pym to transport her back to the Rotten Dimension. Although she was defeated, Zombie still has enough willpower to get her revenge on our reality, and later asked Cosmic to give her the ability to travel across time and space. Nowadays, Zombie would spend her time having fights with the intergalactic Fang. Costume. She wears the same clothes as Bean, but in tatters and dirt. Teams, solitary, or with other villains. Order inspiration, zombies, and being. Well, those are the two characters I have to introduce to see if things would work out and to see if it's worth it for you guys. You know, and I'm sorry if it's a little too bright. I wasn't entirely sure, you know. I'm just saying. And if you guys want, you can like, subscribe, comment down below, and share if you want. You know how it is. Hope you guys have a fine rest of your time. A fine New Year's Eve and such. And until next time, in transmission.